Televisions of Doom. Oh boy. This is gonna be uh, something. Destroy the majestic car. So what? <laughs> the majestic car. You, you mean this majestic I car? Say, that vacuum cleaner salesman made I mean, very is it that majestic? It kind of just looks like the other ones, but black. Yeah. I mean, it, it's fast. You know, because it's a car. But... Alright, fine. Uh, oh, does my... Oh, my ammo resets itself. Oh, that's that's very handy. That's great then. Oh, this will be super easy then. You want me to destroy the car before? I had one ammo before. I didn't realize it was going to reset. Then, yeah, this is going to be the easiest mission in the world. I wish I knew that before. I would have shot it down the second I saw it. Oh, here you are. Yo. I, you're not really speeding up considering you are being shot several times. I would, I would be moving a lot faster if I were you. Like, uh, oh, well, you just yeeted that person. Retrieve the briefcase from the majestic, from the majestic agents. <laughs> Why are they called majestic? I don't know. They don't look very majestic. <laughs> They're just like dying on the pavement. They sure are. Rip all of you. Collect the discarded briefcase. I got it. See ya. Uh, I need to get out of here. This looks diabolical. The briefcase contains a reel of magnetic tape and orders to commence an experiment in human mind. I love how my door is just slamming itself because they're the witness. waiting at the TV station for these orders. He's an expert on the He's human getting tickled brain. by the wind and it His doesn't like it. <laughs> Sleepy I want you to go to the TV station and scan Sleepy Ernst. Sleepy Ernst. Okay. Uh, this is cool. I'm really getting into this game. It's very silly. I mean, let's not say I wasn't before, because, you know, I really enjoy destroying everyone, but... <laughs> oh, Christ! <laughs> you were... you were... you were very... <laughs> you were very motivated about your renal probing. Yeah, but there's something great about, you know, vaporising the shit out of everyone. Feels magnificent. I genuinely can't actually remember, like, the plot of, um, the second game. All I remember is that it was multiplayer, and you could do a lot of dumb shit like prank calls and stuff. Mm. I uh, I couldn't tell you what it's like. But I uh, will probably do it at some point. The, the, the remake is just the first game, right? Yeah, it's just the first game. Unless, like, yeah, so. surprise, we're going to add in the second game as well. I mean, the way THQ's been doing recently, that would be a very THQ thing to do. Oh, I've, I've scanned Sleepy Ernst, I must now destroy Sleepy Ernst, okay. Uh, I mean, technically they could definitely add the multiplayer aspect of 2 in. Oh, well, there was a two-player thing. Yeah. We better That's make cool. sure his work is destroyed. Destroy his car. Okay, just end his whole career. Majestic intended to broadcast mind control signals to control their own people. By transmitting signals from this station, they hope to make the Bye. population paranoid I must and aggressive. Flee well, as paranoid old lady. <laughs> David saw my message. We'll oh yes. <laughs> he, he's apologizing profusely to me. He doesn't need to apologize. A few minor adjustments to those it went exactly as planned. Go to the human dwelling. <laughs> These are such weird ways of just saying go to the yard. <laughs> Going to use this television thingy ourselves to 
subjugate humanity to the indomitable will of the Furon Empire! <laughs> Where did you get I'm up sorry. to in the pit? The I blacked it out, to be honest. I was so traumatized. That's, that's, to that's my fine. Uh, I like that the, uh, the guy the just literally did a chaos laugh. Okay, it's the exact same laugh. Reasons, you have only three minutes. If you cannot align the antennae, very bad things will happen. Let's not speak of it again. Now, get out there and bend some rabbit ears. What am I doing? Use PK to bend all the antennas of an antenna. Right, okay, that's... I've, it's not a lot of time, but... Uh... Oh, okay. That's simple enough. <laughs> I can do that. This is weird. Like, oh. This is a weird chapter. <laughs> I like it. Only it's fitting you started there. off with that fan fiction then. Yeah, no, it's great. I don't regret it. <laughs> I do. Yeah, no, I sort of do. Part <laughs> of it will be cut out. It does, uh, it, it does sure go real dark real fast. But, uh, yeah, no, I, where, where had you heard it before? David. Oh, David, yeah, right. It's a shame he told you about it, because I was really hoping he hadn't. Well, I asked him to read it to me, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> well, like, with, he uh, told... for, for context on how I heard it, uh, it was 2 a.m., <laughs> uh, Actually, was it was it the night where it was two a.m. Maybe it was maybe it was the night where it was one a.m. It was one a.m. I was tired. I wanted to go to bed. David was about to leave, but before he did, <laughs> he thought, "Oh, I'll I'll introduce you to to this." Um, and you know what? It was one of the I cried. Teal. Mm -hmm. How would you feel <laughs> about David reading you more? Oh great, yeah, that'll be fine. Right uh, now. Well, <laughs> yeah, fuck it, bring him in, why not? <laughs> bring him in. Fucking bring him in right now. Do it. How how do I fucking get him? Um Oh wait, but oh he'll have to record his own audio. Fuck. Oh you... fuck. No, bring him in anyway. Uh uh, uh Just tell him to start recording audio first before he joins the call. But this is gonna be a mess. <laughs> to <Yeah>. say. <laughs> it's gonna be an absolute mess. <laughs> oh god. He can, he can. Let me let me let me let me fucking add him Christ. Why have I done? This is why you don't this is why you don't invite me to things, Teal. Oh, oh my god, what uh, It kicked uh, me out. <laughs> Yeah, it kicked you out. Great. Good stuff. <laughs> Hi, David. I don't think he's joined yet. Ah. Uh. Oh, Christ. <laughs> what a what a treat this is. Oh, my God. Everyone's head's exploding. What? <laughs> this is what happens when you read the t -pick. Oh, my God. <laughs> your, your head just what? explodes. What? Oh, this is weird. Freak lightning strikes, entire block kills 12. Local electrician to answer in court for faulty ground wiring. Local personality feared missing. Fans mourn disappearance of Sleepy Ernst. Poor Sleepy Ernst. I do miss Sleepy Ernst. He was a yes. lovely guy. <laughs> you, like, looked at him and then instantly fucking killed him. Yeah, I, no, I read his mind first. I, I was courteous. I wanted to see if he had any really weird... If he did, was any to, like, the really kinky shit. Uh, and he wasn't. Um, so I fucking vaporized him. Um, and that's my story, and I'm sticking with it. You can't stop me. I can't believe you shamed him for having no kinks. Yeah. I mean, what kind of scumbag has no kinks? Like, God, at least do anal. Anal was for pussies. <laughs> Oh, I, I, I guess anal's kind of mandatory in a world where you've got aliens just anal probing you. Yeah. Exactly. Oh. 
Okay, so there's Santa Pri. Time for a geography lesson. Travel to the landmarks and the Cairns quickly. Okay, so it is just a race thing. Cool. Can do. Seems simple enough. I Hello, can, I can do David. <laughs> ah, the D is here. Oh, God. Hello. This, this point. Are, are you recording? Oh, yeah. <laughs> can, can you record your audio, good sir? So I'm bang on and I'm recording. Excellent! What were you recording? I was doing some red steel. Anyway, I didn't mean to just <gasps> drop in Woo! like this. Sorry. Oh, you this, were? This pleases mm -hmm. me. This pleases me. The, Hi. The only the only reason I am here is because I've heard you've been doing you've been reading this poor girl fanfic of the most disgusting kind. Yes, and half of it will be cut out probably. <laughs> But, Why? Is it because it's that bad? Because, I mean, yeah, it's, it's pretty... Would you like to read some? It's, <laughs> yeah, but, where did you get to? Uh, not far. <laughs> I read, like, the first couple of paragraphs. Um, I started on, I think, the second paragraph, and then I moved briefly into the uh, ET, and then it's like, nah, I think we're done here. Um, but ET is... Uh, ET was... Well, what a What a glorious... Uh, fan fiction. Where did you it's find it? It's one this? of the best. Is so, it? <laughs> a friend. <laughs> a friend it is. It's, uh, it's the best. A friend sent me on a website called Topless Robot, which they dissected it for the first chapter bit by bit. Um, oh. have you, you haven't read the chapter three, have you? No. Oh, boy. Oh, oh Jesus. You, you, read, you read me chapter one um, when I was visiting, and. Uh, I was very tired, and it made it funnier than it probably should have been. Oh but the God. great, the, the thing is, you have such a lovely voice, which is is born for for broadcasting. And, he does. And, and reading sol awful fan fiction. Your sol yeah, and your sultry voice really adds a lot of uh, bravitas <coughs> to the whole piece. Oh, I mean, that's how I so. heard it. It's because David talked about it, and then I, for some un God forsaken reason, was like, yes, you should read this on stream. Yeah. Here's, here's Elliot's Dream. Did you get to Elliot's Dream? I did read Elliot's Dream, yes. Oh, gosh, yeah, you've already hit... That's the that's that's the worst of it in this first in the first chapter. Yeah, Elliot, Elliot's Dream is fucking weird. Uh, Elliot really needs to sort out his... Like, he needs to see someone. Uh, E.T. specifically, but uh, besides E.T., he needs to see someone. Yes, definitely. Um, sh oh, I just I just halfway through chapter two and I've just died multiple times inside. <laughs> I'm so Excellent. sorry, David. I'm not. I encourage the worst things. Oh, God. It's even worse than chapter one in multiple ways. Oh, I'm just going to... boy. Are you okay to cut this out if this goes badly? Because, <laughs> boy, this is a fun one. Ah, oh, fucking, just to go for it. Being a little femboy at heart, he put oh, on Jesus silk panties. Oh, Jesus Christ, it started <laughs> off fucking magically. Finding oh, they didn't boy. cause his ass to be uncomfortable, since his ass seemed to be getting unnecessary sensitive to men's undergarments. Then he put on some hot pants and looked at himself in the mirror in the bedroom he saw that he had a delicious bubble butt. Bouncy, squeezable, not fat, but plump and firm. Then <gasps> Elliot looked for a good shirt to match his pink hot pants. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, amazing. I, amazing. I, I, I actually, I honestly can't read out the next sentence because it is offensive to a large number of people. Right. <laughs> I see. Not that that bit wasn't offensive, but yeah, this is... Yeah. Oh, Christ. Th this I, is significantly worse, then. I should just drop out and let you guys have fun because <laughs> uh, you, you can't you can't just do this and bail on us. <sighs> That's not how this works. You say that. Is it like, not how this works? Like I didn't coerce him into doing this. Yeah, no. That's true. <laughs> you did. I mean, it was kind game. of a group effort. We all kind of suggested it. <laughs> yeah, well, when when you played it for me in Manchester, I was just like, well, I have to read it to Squid in the recording because it's extremely stupid. Um, but yeah, and then then it descended because like this whole series has been fucking ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, it yes. has. There's been a lot of talk about anal probing and lube, and how if you don't use lube when getting anal probed, your head will explode. 
That sounds fun, but it's also right. Did I just pretty... do all the missions here? Have you done everything? Are you uh, an are you an everything boy? Uh I well those are the Okay, well the trophies that are showing up are the ones for Dragon Quest, so that's not right. Um Yeah, that's all the side missions. Alright, well this whole level's done. Sweet. Um cool. Uh continue. Uh, <laughs> You don't want that. So he gets to a point where literally Elliot gets birthed inside. Like, um, oh god, Elliot, I remember this part. Elliot basically, Kamelka sucks Elliot into his. You know, you know those wacky weight, wacky um, inflatable tube men. Yes. Wacky wavy inflatable tube men. Think of one of those, but it's a penis and it can fit Elliot inside, <laughs> and it's attached to a womb at the other end, and that's this chapter. <laughs> Ah, that's hot. That's hot. Ah. Ag, whimper, Kamelka cried as he felt his lover go oh, yeah. through into oh, his womb. Yeah. E.T. is called Kamelka or something. Yeah, that's it. It just sounds it. like Cloaca. <laughs> I mean, it does, well, yes. Feeling the last part of his love sink deep inside of him as his bald and empty... No. This is this is not a YouTube this is not YouTuber probes. I can hear the regret in David's voice. Why yeah. why does he listen to things I say? The 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 author's note for this is how'd you like them apples? I'd like to return them apples, please. Um Green Pussy. No, that's not the right word. Chapter three is where it gets very weird. <laughs> Good. It hasn't been weird enough already. <sighs> Standing up with a little strain on his back, but he was able to take it for now. Later he might get the superintendent to get his food for him. Those in his control had no memory of what they do for him and are powerless to resist his mental powers. Upon getting to the kitchen, he found the fridge was filled with junk food. Taking out and thawing the ice crease cake, he had a large spoon from a drawer and went to the went into the bedroom. Lying back on the bed with the cake on his chest, he turned down to the television in the bedroom and turned it to one of his favourite shows, Big Bang Theory. Oh no! Oh god, this is ultra cursed. When you said this was the worst part, I didn't know you really meant it, David. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's no, it'd be, it'll be little Sheldon if it was really the worst thing ever. Um, hey, yeah, young Sheldon is not <coughs> as bad, I don't think. Fair, fair, I'll give I, you that. I, I, think it, I think it's probably better than Big Bang Theory because it's not like being massively... Like offensive to any nerd culture. <laughs> That's good. Yeah, no, and it's also like some of the jokes in it are like pretty stale. Yeah, it's just like takes the mick out of the people who actually are the, are the ones who like it, I guess. Yeah. This goes on though. Um, on. The way humans try to act smart amused him. Eating the vanilla ice cream cake made his mouth and stomach happy. Spoonful after spoonful, the sweet dessert filled his mouth. Kamelka was helpless to deny his sweet tooth. Sweet tooth. I also like vanilla. Vanilla. Van vanilla. <laughs> Fuck. The. the <laughs> Elliot said in Kamalka's mind. Up already, love, Kamalka replied as he was licking the cream from his spoon. Yeah, I suddenly tasted vanilla and felt like I was being fed suddenly. It's a nice feeling, Elliot said, sounding and feeling better about his predicament. At this point, Elliot's inside the womb and they're communicating from, like, in, it's inter-womb communication oh, right now. Jesus. Oh, Jesus. That's, that's cute. Good, nice to know you like it. Hmm, I love humans' food. No other species taste such pride in what they eat. Hmm, hmm. I can't help but fill my stomach with their country. With their concoctions, Kamelka was quite content in his gluttonous mouth stuffing. I think ice cream is the only vanilla thing they like. Yeah. It basically ends with them playing Billy Joel. But why? <laughs> but and why says, though? And it says to be continued and it never is continued. Oh, what a shame. Um, I think they were that's, arrested. Oh, that's a, they that's a big it. pity. I think Steven Spielberg would really like to continue E.T. the sequel that's, that never happened. E.T. and Elliot coming back to me. Yeah, it's um, it was published in January the 11th, 2012, and it was updated in May the 16th, 2012. So it was a someone wrote that on a fever dream for a little while. <laughs> well, they've done wonderful work, and we are, we are blessed. <laughs> <laughs> have you read some of these reviews? Oh, I have Please not. Bless but us go on. Them. Update this story, damn it! I was hooked, and then nothing. Come on, by Stucky Lover Seven Thirteen. Apparently, C asks, "Can you please explain to me what pink ass juice is?" I'm not familiar. Pepto Bismol. Yeah, basically. 
Having read this monstrosity, I feel that I have lost part of myself, and I shall never find it again. The part of me is dead now, and the rest of my being wishes to join it, as only the sweet, merciful embrace of death can free me from the evil that you have unleashed upon the world. But I have to work to do before I can rest. Oh yes, there is so much work to be done. Something must cleanse the world of this horror, and it shall be me. That's a mood. I respect the, the one man goal to end <laughs> E.T. and his terrifyingly shriveled cock. It, please do more soon. This is good, and I want to know what happens. Keep up the good work. I mean, it was good work. Someone a did good work. A guy called Dan Fix, who has a picture of Sora with opening his mouth from Kingdom Hearts 1, says, Dude, this is bloody amazing. Fucked up for sure, but nonetheless amazing. Please, please continue it. Well, you know what? I respect that loads of people like the work. Um, that's nice, I guess, for the creator. Um, it's yeah, it's nice to know people whacked off to your ET fanfic. Yeah, <laughs> it is nice. That is nice. It's definitely a very yeah. specific set of fetishes. Yeah, no, unbirthing and rebirthing is fairly specific set. I mean, if you think about it hard enough, you can probably imagine a flashlight being being ET. <laughs> I mean, they do do them with like famous people on them, so why not do ET, ET? butthole? Yeah. Yeah, one. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, no, you could sell that. You could sell that to a really specific group of people. Yeah, oh, that's a normal thing, right? Yeah, 100%. Yeah, cool. Um, might pick that up at some point. I don't have to. I mean, we all How's remember that? the Teal, though. Oh, yeah, the Teal. Oh, oh, yeah, Teal was great. I still got your design for the Impulse Dildo in my, in my work in progress chat. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Have you seen this thing? I mean, that was... that was not... like, that was basically... Iblis Dildo is a thing from Tomo's stream. Or was it? Yeah, it was Tomo's, right? Yes, it was. Yeah. And, uh, and then I, as a joke, made a 3D model in paint in five seconds. <laughs> and, uh... It was shit. I it was truly it. shit. I that was like it. a that was like a Klingon weapon of pain. Looks great, right? Yeah, no, I wouldn't put that anywhere near myself. I'm sure would. some people would. I mean, at least it's got a flared base. Let's be honest, but that's about as far as it goes. It's great. Lovely. I did that, it. That's in my magic. Discord well done. Forever. It's in my. That's in your what? Program. Sorry. <laughs> well, to be honest, if it was in you, it would be in forever. Those, I mean, I should know they're forward facing, so it's fine. If they were facing the other way, then yeah, you'd be screwed. Oh, it's in my it's work like a... in progress channel forever. Oh, good. Yep. Work in progress. Right, that's what you said. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>